I hope this is sewing machine or sewing machine. I have just arrived to post office because I have an order sewing machine. Very interesting device. Let's go to check it out. А я себе тоже. Ну я буду смотреть. Старая машинка. Я себе старую купил. Нет, у меня новая машинка. А, я старый купил Зингер. Знаете какого года? 1904 года. Похоже. В общем, ладно, там сундук какой-то. Хорошо сохранилось. Да. Рисунок такой прям ну. красивый. Если что, потом откроем музей старых вещей. Ладно. Объявление дадите, мы вам принесем, привезем. Еще у вас есть старые, да? Так я говорю, у меня три, нет, Что четыре говорите? штуки, наверное, стоят в погребе. Ну ладно, я ее вот так вот Это сразу. у меня дома новые, а в погребе у меня такие деревянные. Ага. Вот, все, все как родное. Одна машинка еще от бабушки. Это, наверное, у меня от прабабушки. Очень старая. Вот, а у вас где мусор? Original Victoria. Everything is original. This is how it looks inside. But we'll check it later at home. I paid for this machine around $70. But I think I overpaid because there was another option to buy for $35. And I asked what's the difference? And the seller said that this cover is original, everything is original. So I overpaid twice. And even though now I see that this cover is not original, because it doesn't fit here, see? There is a gap here. And on this side, like this. So I think it's from different machine. Anyway, I have this cover and our machine looks like this and I already tried it a little bit how it works so basically it works it can saw but the problem is in this winder and the seller didn't tell it to me because this winder doesn't work Okay, I'll show you first what you need to do. You need to get this shuttle. Shuttle looks like a boat. Then in this shuttle there is bobbin, which you need to take out. And in order to wind a thread, you need to insert it here. But the problem is, it doesn't wind anything. Wait, we need to stop it somehow. The problem, I don't know how to stop it. Ah, okay. Now I stopped the sewing mechanism. And see, it does not wind. So I need to fix it somehow later. Now, in order to sew something, I have to wind it by hand. Also here there is this box where you can keep your threads. By the way, here it's also not original. Looks a little bit strange with this one. But anyway, now I will wind thread on our bobbin like this it will take me a while 
when our thread is ready we need to thread our shuttle and you need to insert thread into these holes to make tension so i'll quickly do it again you need to insert your shuttle right here like this close this close that and we're ready also i forgot to mention that here there is a serial number i already checked this number and it means that this machine was made in 1904 so it is more than 100 years and also it was made in scotland now i want to show you how it works by fixing my pants uh, by fixing my shorts here i have a hole and i will sew a patch like this i already tried to sew one patch here and now i'll sew a second one somewhere here like this This is how the patch looks at the back and this is in front. I think it looks decent. At least I don't need to do it by hand. Now I have to fix Now I have to fix this part because here it's all metal and when this one touches this one there is no friction and it stays on the same place it does not rotate so my plan is to glue to glue here rubber Now I'll press it with the same bobbin. And now I have to wait until it dries. Now I will show you the result of my fix. This is the fix, how it looks here. Rubber inside now. With this little fix now I can work on this machine on my 118 years old machine it is like brand new for me now <laughs> 